Associated Press says that Earth is spinning faster um, and no cause for the concern, scientists say. Well, others say that it should be. Some think it could be dangerous. Some think it's no cause for concern. These are the type of issues that we have. Like, this is the issues that we have when we have problems going on. It's always a scientist that's right there to say it's nothing wrong. Always a scientist that says that something is wrong. Why is that? Why is there a person there to prove something wrong and prove it not wrong? Why can't we just understand what's happening? And then based off of our understanding, then anybody that jumps to say something is wrong or something is not wrong, be skeptical. Trust me. All right, let's get into the article. Um, Earth is spinning faster than usual. Here's how it's affecting you. It says June 29th, 2022 was uh, 1.5 uh, milliseconds shorter than the average day. Scientist uh, Leonid uh, Zoltov told CBS News the normal length of the day is 24 hours or 86,400 seconds. But the past few, you, past few years, the Earth's rotation has picked up trimming milliseconds off some days since 2016 the earth um started to accelerate will be causing uh they really don't know but it's funny because uh the so-called conspiracy nuts we were told that there would be something like this going on we were told this we were told that there would be a new world order and we were called conspiracies and then just a couple months ago i've actually heard Democrats say something about a new liberal world order. So all the things that were conspiracies actually come to fruition. Let's get back to the article. The claim, Earth is spinning faster is no cause for concern, science says. The claim, the Earth is spinning faster and days are getting shorter. A change that is noticeable and cause for immediate concern. That's the claim. Associate Press's um, assessment. Missing context. How? How the fuck? Are you missing context with something that we've never experienced before? If we've never experienced this before, good or bad, we can't say we know what it is. So how could you prove something wrong that you've never experienced or have no data on? Stupid. It's done. Missing context. The Earth did indeed record the shortest day ever thus far on June 29th. 1.59 milliseconds less than 24 hours due to an increase in the planet's rotational speed. However, scientists told the Associated Press that this is a normal function that people won't notice and need to worry about. I disagree. I mean, even right now, something feels different. Like, like me personally, I feel more tired. Like, uh, like there's like a gravitational pull or something. But that's just me personally. I don't know. So let's look at the other article. Oh, uh, well, actually, I guess we covered both of them. I don't know. You do you do your own homework and see what you think about it. I, just, I, I don't know. I, I don't have no opinion. I just want to see what happens. I know that I feel different based off. So if, if me feeling, I feel like lethargic. I've been feeling like that for months, almost years, like lethargic. So if the earth is doing something different, and I know I feel something different, Maybe how I feel, how we feel, what's going on is we won't know until years to come.